Alright, welcome back guys. It's time for our second attempt at this game with the... Well, as I said last time, we've pretty much gone through all our ships. So now it's gonna be like, just doing the ships that I, uh, I feel like playing. Um, until I get some more, uh, unlocked. Uh, I think I said it this last time, but... The Federation Cruiser is kind of my favorite ship at the moment. So we'll probably be seeing, or you'll probably be seeing, uh, videos with, uh, mostly those. Or mostly this ship. Alright. So... I was gonna go down this way, but I wanna, uh, it, the closer you stay to the middle, the more nodes you get connected to, and the more chance you'll find a distress signal, so... Let's try and stick to the middle this this round. You stumble across a Ford Scout of the Rebel Fleet. Alright. They are powering up their FTL. If they get away, they, they will no doubt warn the fleet of your position. So, we have nothing but burst laser at this moment. So we're going to have to focus completely on their engine systems. And... I'm actually going to be very pessimistic and say that we might not be able to stop these guys. Ah. My pessimism, my pessimism might have been proven wrong. Oh, I forgot to do the auto fire. They brought in more guys to repair. There we go. An art artillery beam to the rescue. The ship breaks apart and you're relieved to know that you are still one step ahead of the fleet. One missile, one drone, and 23 scrap. Alright, let's go here. Uh, upon completing your jump, you receive a message from a nearby ship. Greetings and welcome to our beacon. For a small fee, we'll let you continue on your way. Pay the toll? Ha! I think not. Too bad, you will regret this decision. I regret nothing. They offer you some of their goods if you don't destroy their ship. Two fuel, two missiles, and 13 scrap. I think not. Two fuel, one drone part, 24 scrap. Alright, I like that. A distress beacon. Perfect. It appears the distress beacon is coming from the surface of a nearby moon. Your sensors are picking up a single life form. Go down to the surface to investigate. You find a colony that seems to have been recently attacked. Exploring the dev devastation, you find a lone survivor. Uh, let's invite him to join our crew. He hesitates. Uh, he states that he was a pilot before being stranded. He happily offers his service for a time in exchange for getting off that rock. All right, welcome aboard, Charlie. And Nikimi, let's put you in the sensors because we now have Charlie, the pilot. All right. On to the next distress beacon. Or I, actually, this is just a regular beacon. You are immediately contacted by a settlement. Hello, travelers. Your ship seems to be outfitted for combat. Care to take up a bit of mercenary work? Listen to their offer. 
A space dock is under assault from the rebels. Although the dock is technically illegal with, uh, within their laws, it's very important for our trade. We'll pay you in fuel and scrap if you promise to save them. All right. They transmit the space dock's coordinates. Add a quest marker to your map. All the way down there. Let's swing by the store first. See what kind of goods we can get. Drones. Mine control. Backup battery. Drone control. FTL recharge booster. Stealth weapons. And advanced FTL navigation. I don't want any of this. <laughs> Ion Intruder Drone breaches through the enemy hole and randomly ionizes systems. Oh, that's actually a new dr uh, new drone. I've never actually seen that one before. All right, I'm just gonna buy some fuel and move on. You barely have time to register the junk completion before your ship warns you of an incoming sh ship with weapons hot. Alright. Target their weapons. Go. They have a laser and a beam. So we definitely want to take that laser down so the beam doesn't hit us like it just did. Ah, they've caught on fire. That guy's almost dead, too. He's got 50 health. 30 health. One more barrage, guys. Oh, our artillery, artillery laser. That works, too. The ship explodes, leaving us three fuel, one drone, and 24 scrap. Once you arrive at the beacon, you detect a rebel scout assaulting a compound on a nearby desolate moon. Engage in the rebels and rescue the space dock. Looks like they have a laser and missile, I think. Well, that's definitely a laser. Oh no, that's a mine, I think. Oh, thank god we took out the weapon systems before it fired. So what that is, is it teleports a mine onto your ship and then it explodes. I really love burst lasers. So nice. Oh, their guy's almost dead. He's got 10 health. The outpost hails you. Thank you. I don't know what we would, what we did to anger the rebels, but they are ready to kill us. I'll show you our goods and patch up your hull. 20 scrap and two hull points repaired. I don't think our ship was damaged, but 20 ship, 20 uh, scrap. I'll take it. Ooh, and they also sell us stuff. Let's see here. Swarm missiles. Small bomb charge ion, ion charger. Really don't want any of those. FTL jammer. Uh, I guess the only thing, if I wanted anything, would be this. But I'd rather just have a regular ion thing. Alright. 
same thing. I'll buy three fuel and move on. Distress beacon. You find a number of ships fleeing from a small space station. You hail them, asking them what's wrong. Help, we're being overrun by some sort of giant alien spiders. Alright, we'll, uh, we'll help you with the giant alien spiders. The crew slowly creeps up on a cluster of creatures from behind. Without warning, the giant arachnids turn and charge. However, your team stays in control, and before long, you've beaten them back. They are thrilled with your success and offer you reward. Eight missiles, two drones, and ten scrap. Would have liked more scrap than missiles, but okay. You look like a military vessel. We're trying to get back to our homes alive. I'm an engineer by trade and could try to improve your reactor if you have the extra supplies. Sure, I'm not using any of those. Upgrade the reactor by one. Cool. We can get our engines fully online. And since we're here, let's go ahead and upgrade our artillery beam. And on to the next sector. Ooh. This is quite a vicious looking trip we're gonna have. Actually, no, we can actually do this. We'll do the rebel controlled, this nebula, and then do the civilian controlled, ending with the rebel controlled, I believe. Well, distress signal right off the bat. Hello, we used the last of our FTL fuel to jump to this station. They indicate a burnt out husk of debris and warp metal. As you can see, the war must have spread to this sector. We've been stranded ever since. All right, um, sure, I'll give you fuel. I don't like it, but Maybe you'll give me something good. Thank you so much. We don't have too much to offer, but have a look at the sector scans we took. Your map is updated. Okay. Possible ship detected. Unvisited location. Possible ship detected. And a pulsar is flooding in this area. Asteroids. Asteroids. Very close to the sun. And we got a store. So let's do this, 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 and then up to the store, then on to the exit. A small shuttle appears on the local radar. Turns out it's a rebel automated scout. Oh, our pilot got hit. Make sure they don't fly away now. Charlie, go heal yourself up. Two missiles, one drone, and 29 scrap. Rebel automated ship remains stationed near the small Rebel space station. Sensors indicate a stro storage vessel for military goods. Attack the automated ship to get to the storage cache. Once again, take out their weapons. Yes, good, good.
I'll target their engines. Yes, good, good. 34 scrap. Investigate the station. The station was apparently designed to outfit rebel ships with drone systems. You, you find a functioning schematic. Anti-ship beam drone. And four, 17 scrap. Anti-ship beam drone. You stumble across a forward scout of the rebel fleet. Oh no! They have drones. Let's target their weapon systems first. Oh, they're trying to get away. Crap. Target their engines first. We're just going to have to try and survive the their fire. Oh, God. Right to the oxygen. Oh, thank God. Way to pilot, Charlie. Way to pilot. Oh, artillery. Artillery's down. Oh, God, Charlie got hit. <laughs> the ship breaks apart. Two missiles, one drone, 27 scrap. Full health, Charlie. <laughs> Charlie, Charlie took a hit. Go heal yourself up, man. All right. Off to this one. You arrive at a populated sector. One merchant seems to be mass broadcasting a request for a merc mercenary ship to aid him. Shall we respond? Sure. Great. I was worried no one would respond. My usual carrier. Oh, this mission where they ask us to deliver something. Sure. Great. I have loaded their location on their star map. Here's the drone parts. And it's exactly on our way, so... You arrive at the location given to you by, merchant, by the merchant. You are supposed to deliver the drone parts to the station here. You find that a small research station and discover that it's putting out a distress signal. Strange. Strangely, there's no response to your hails. Uh, Alright, dock with the station to investigate. Uh, you dock with the station and see a frantic person banging on the airlock door. Once inside your ship, he drops to the floor saying, My friends, they've gone insane. They're coming... You hand him a blaster and turn to see a number of people charging towards the ship. Prepare to fight. Okay. Get in there and fight. Nicola! Stay strong, buddy. Go heal up. Go heal up. Go heal up. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, get back. Back to sensors. You go heal up. You can stay in the door. I think Pomeroy. Yeah. All right. And Raffin, you're in the shields again. Nicola, heal up. Pomeroy, heal up. All right. Back to the engines to there. Alright, good. Our doors are upgraded now that we have a manned. And our pilots. Oh yeah, we got Charlie, the extra pilot. Alright, cool. Off to the store. 
I guess we get to keep the drone parts. <laughs> All right, let's see what you got. Crew members. I guess first off, let's fix our ship. Buy all their fuel. Um, a beam drone. Anti-ship beam drone. Combat drone that repeatedly attacks with a small beam weapon. Okay. Let's go ahead and get the drone control. guys don't specialize in anything already so I don't think I'm gonna hire any of them and instead whoa it came with a system repair drone cool free stuff all right switch y'all around there we go upgrades right now we have two power slots available in drone control First off, let's get the power that we can do, so we can use that. And we'll upgrade the drone control by one later on, and that way we can have both our drones operational. Alright, let's go to the exit now. across a large trade station. However, as soon as you approach, a warning goes out to all ships in the region. Do not associate with the Federation Sympathizer. All who oppose the rebels will be punished. Let's see if someone will trade. You search for a friendly market that yields no results, but after some, after a time a small shuttle approaches, they release some supplies in your direction with the message, we are not all friends of the rebel fleet. Stay strong. Three fuel, one drone, and 15 scrap. Cool. Thanks, buddy. Off to the next sector. To the Uncharted Nebula. Uh, I think it'd be better to do this route. Kind of an S-shaped. pirate ship arrives shortly after you judging from the fact that it is attempting to avoid your ship you assume that it is a smuggler trying to stay away from beacons attack power up your weapons and move in to engage all right lasers on weapon deploy beam drone haha <laughs> there goes their oxygen Way to be, Beam Drone. Four fuel and 19 scrap. Ignore! Artillery beam. Oh, we lost some of the fuel, but we got a lot of scrap. So that's what that's a nice example of what I was talking about. How sometimes if you decide to destroy it, you, you might lose something. But I think it was worth it, because at this moment, I think we need more scrap than anything. You jump into a sector of the nebula beset by Plasma Storm. Oh god, not this place. Alright. We have one power. Alright, let's power down the medic bay so we can power up our lasers. Have the lasers attack the weapon. Good. 
go. We have no shields. Oh my god, Charlie, way to be. Way to be, Charlie. Alright, take out their shields. Can't believe we missed. There we go. One more hit and their shields would be down. There we go. Oh, almost. There we go. Ooh, stealth weapons. 42 scrap, one fuel, and one drone part. Now, the stealth weapons augmentation isn't really useful right now, mainly because we don't have the cloaking system. But if we do get it later on, it's extremely nice to have that, that bonus because it allows you to shoot while you're cloaked. Hmm. It's worrying that the rebels have penetrated so deep into uncharted space, even if it is only an unmanned craft. It arms its weapons. You should do the same. All right, pause, because we need to redistribute our power. And why do I have three? Oh, because our sensors are down, because we're in the nebula storm. All right. Um, how many drones parts do we have? Thirteen. All right. In that case, target the shields. So my beam guy can do some damage. We'll try to get through this as fast as possible. We might take a hit. Yep. Yep, we took a hit. If we can get their shields down, my beam drone will just take them apart. There we go. Two missiles, one drone, 27 scrap. Alright. Time to make the jump. Actually. There we go. Now let's upgrade drone controls by one and additional power. There we go. So now we can have all our drones working at the same time. Alright. Let's go here, then here, then we'll exit. Nothing happens. Damn plasma storms. scout seems to be waiting for you all right lasers attack weapons yep oh hold on if I take down my med bay and my door control oh no I can't take out my door control all right, I was gonna say we could put them into shields, but let's up our engines to top, keep our evade up. There we go. The ship appears to be powering its FTL. It's trying to escape. I'll let you escape. One fuel, one drone, 18 scrap. You can do better. I'm 
See, you do a lot better. <laughs> we gain an additional fuel and at least 20 scrap.